Hey everybody, it's Stacey at Scrap Mania and we've got a large penny black order and we've got a bunch of samples I want to show you too. So we're going to go over um, all of the new stuff and all of the beautiful samples from Penny Black. <laughs> Look who's joining me. This is after our dentist. So we have now taken the cotton out of our mouth and she is going to join us for a video before we head home for the day because apparently I have two sick children at home that we need to stay away from, don't we? Yeah, we have cooties. Yes, cooties, cooties, also known as strep throat. So we don't want to get any of that. All right, so this is the first sample that we're going to show you. Again, these are all from Penny Black. And this has got the nice stamp on it of the flowers. You've got sentiments, and then you also have this dye around the outside. And we're going to show you that dye in a whole bunch of these card samples because it's a brand new one and it's really cool. So this stamp set is using these flowers here. And this set is called Unfolding. And they are really nice. And then, let's see. Where's that die at, Brigan? What die? The one with all these little rectangle frame things. Okay, so here is the die that goes around the outside on this. And there's, uh, there's probably four samples that use this set. And I've really gotten good feedback on it. Because this was actually out on the shelf today um, before... Uh, we did the video. So these are selling like hotcakes. This one is called Square Frames. You get five different frames. One popped out of there. Let's see if we can pop her back in. There we go. Um, so you've got five different frames, <coughs> all with the little uh, rectangles interlocking. And it's just really different. Something that nobody has done before. I think a lot of the companies try and kind of copy each other and this one has not been done yet so that's pretty cool and then on this sample here there are some uh, sentiments and things on there and I don't have all the information written on the back but I'm going to get that done before the cards get put out so here is that stamp set again and it's called unfolding and here's the same yes that is another Dive. sample Excuse the piles of boxes in the background. Um, We've got a lot of orders, so yep. you guys have to take it all. Yep, lots of inventory coming in. So this is also another stamp, uh, or another sample using the unfolding. Hold that one back up. So we'll show you. You've got two totally different looking cards from the same same stamp set. So that's a nice one. Okay, what else different. do we have? And then. We don't have a sample of this one. This one is called a floral twist. And as you can see up here, and actually on the back I'll show you. Very pretty. Not a lot of coloring. Some of these require coloring, some of them don't. Um, some of them also have the watercolor look, so it just depends on what you're going for. This one we have a sample up front. Uh, we got this before Valentine's Day, but it just says love. It does not have to be for Valentine's Day. It can be for wedding, it can be for anniversary, it can be for lots of stuff. And we sold out of it. Um, let me show you the package. There's a sample in the back. Um, cute little dog sitting on top of the love. Um, we've got a few different samples up front using that. So we did get that back in stock. And like I said, it's not just for Valentine's Day. And... Um, Dyes are on sale for the rest of February, so if you um, are seeing this and it's still February, stop in and grab them at a discount, 14% off. If it's after February when you're seeing this, I'm sorry that you missed it, uh, but we will have more specials in February, so watch for those. But I don't, or not for, there will be more specials in March. February will be over, but I don't have those uh, picked yet. So what have you got next? The next one is like, <coughs> excuse me, the next one has a butterfly what's it called it's called the butterfly and leaves there's a nice sample on the back i don't know if all their packages show samples on the back i think I'll have they to do. look because that's kind of nice yeah you can... all right so oh, that's pretty so you hold up the sample and then i will talk about the car or the stamp this one is called harmony and you can color it in. Um, they kind of watercolor looked it here. Um, or you can color it in with like Copics or colored pencils, anything like that. Here they did not do the watercolor look on the sample, but on the packaging they kind of went for the watercolor look. So you've got different yeah. options for that. And that one is called Harmony. And again, all of these are by Penny Black. Okay, you hold that. Next we have this glitter flower. 
and that one is using those same rectangular um oh yeah here that we want to we're going to keep showing called the square frames bev gartner i know you're going to want this one give us a call we'll get it on hold for you and um it's just so simple i think it would look cool to even do more than one layer of them since they oh, yeah. are stacked and so that is the die that was used. And then what stamp was that one? That's got the big flower. How did, how did our pile get messed up? The big flower. The big one. We'll how be did... back when we find it. <laughs> okay, we have located the stamp. So this is the sample that Brigham was showing you. And it's using uh, the flower called Radiant. And here they uh, stamped it and kind of uh, watercolored, sl real sloppy. They didn't go um, even all the way outside to the edges, and then they did add some glitter. Yeah, this one's kind of like that too. It's just like... And there they just kind of did the silhouette. And on this one, this is the same exact stamp. Uh, they did, they stamped it, but then they filled it in. So totally different looks with the same exact stamp set. And that one is called Radiant by Penny Black. The next one we have are these cute uh, saying stamps. Helpful, hilarious, relatable, and awesome friends. Keep Compassionate. So they can see it. Oh, sorry. Trustworthy, thoughtful, and then there's some thankful for being dot dot dot. And some flowers. All right, this is one of my favorites. This one is so pretty. Really um, pretty. They're all really pretty though. They are, uh, we've got a few different options on this one. This is done with the uh, Blooming Boots stamp, which is right here. And then there is a coordinating die, but they did not use it on this, but you definitely should pick up both. And the thank you um, for making my day is this set here, which is called Grateful Sentiments. And so they used the thank you, and then there's different things you can add on to it. So lots of different options for that. And then they also have the square or the rectangle um, frame die as well. Here I have two more samples of this die called... Um, I have these two can help you hold samples of the Poppy Enger think. So here is a close-up sample of this one. And that one is called the Poppy Edger is what the um wait, I think you got the wrong one. <laughs> we're showing okay, these are not the same stamps. Oops. So if we're gonna show the Poppy Edger, <laughs> we gotta show the Poppy Edger sample and not some other random sample. So this is the Poppy Edger, and it's a die, not a stamp. And then they just uh, colored it. And that's a really pretty one. Okay. Next, <laughs> we have this one. And do you have the stamp set that uh, goes with it? No, don't. No, you're making a mess. You can't do it that way. <laughs> set it aside, and when we get to it, we'll kay. talk about that one. Okay, that one will come back, because somehow Brigham's pile... A mess. Yeah, somehow Brigham's pile got messed up, so we're going to come back to that one. So I will show you this one here. This one is really nice. This one is using the tulip stamps called Softly. And here is another example this time. Is that the Softly? Okay, yep. so there's the one that Brigham was missing her stamp set for. And so totally different, different too, yep, yeah. totally different uh, cards using the same die or the same stamp. And then that one that Brigham has is also using these um, on the square frames outside. again on the edging. Here I have some cute sayings. Two small words to express so much gratitude. Thank you. You're super magical. Joy is a choice, so keep on choosing it. Enjoy the journey and let your heart take care of the rest. And there's a bunch more. Those were only two of them. And on the back it has it. An example, your dream does not have an explanation date. Expiration. 
Okay, so that Thank one is you. called what? It is called Clear Set. Nope, that one is called no, it's not. Sentiments. It's called Sentiments. So, if you're looking for the Sentiments set, that's what that one is. 30-544. What does it tell you? The name is down here, okay. and then that's the code. We don't need the code usually, but since that one's just called Sentiments, which is kind of a boring um, name, I figured I'd give the code on it also. So this is fun. I like that they did the flowers in blue. Again, they're using the um, die of the square frames, so you're going to want these because they use them on every single card almost. And this is the stamp set that they used, and it's called Together, and it's a really pretty floral set. And then they did do some other stamping in the background, which I believe looks like these here off of the Floral Silhouette stamp set. So that's a nice one. And then they also did uh, Grateful You Are There to Hold My Hand. And we'll have to look that up to see which stamp set that that came with. Because we got so much Penny Black in today. And they are definitely one of our favorites. Here I have um, some... A sample and it says with love and here is the stamp that goes with it called the painter vase the painter's vase and then that also has those same the square outside. frames in it we're gonna run out of those square frames so if you Very are interested fast, in those so. you need to pick those up because they are on all of the cards and they're going to fly out of here. So here is a sentiment set. I believe this is the one Brigham already read. So we're going to forget that one and move on. <laughs> here is um, another sample. I bought lots of samples at the Creativation. So I know you guys like samples and I don't always have time to make them. So I purchased a bunch. Um, this one has this beautiful butterfly on it. And then I don't know how well you can see it in the video. But there is some uh, framing here with some cool stitching on it. And it's called Swirly Stitches. And that is from this set here. You get four different dies and they are stacked. And there are several cards that actually use those. I showed this card earlier, but it also uses the swirly frames. So it just adds a little bit of an accent to the card. And then um, this one is called Monarch, which was also used in this and it is a really pretty die that's very detailed and elegant as well. Here I have a tree stamp. And the example is on the back. But this does not have an We do not have a thingy. sample for that sample. one yet. Yet. So here is a cute little guy for St. Patrick's Day. And he's called Irish Luck. And his sentiments are... Um, he's got the little banner that says Irish luck and then it also says a little so if you want to do a little Irish luck you can do that and there is a die cut for your little teddy bear and also for the banner if you want to cut the banner out. Here I have a hedgehog in a cup thinking of you a cup of tea makes everything better or a few things and on the back is example super cute and fun. All right, so we have a couple little mini samples, and these are using the Critter Celebration set. You've got those cute little mice, and they, they were doing all sorts of different things, and we've also got uh, teddy bears in this set too. So the ones on the dock are teddy bears, and then um, looks like all the other ones are cute little mice. So you've got blowing dandelions, sitting in flowers with presents, sitting in flowers with a little uh, letter, like a love letter, and then sitting on the dock. And here are some cute little samples using that. And then there is also this die here, um, which we're going to have to locate which one that one is. Um, <coughs> we were trying to find that one earlier, and I think I might have forgotten to order that one, but we'll get that one ordered on the next shipment. Here I have another bear. It says, Happy Birthday, and I, it is called Balloon Ride. I like with, like, with like dull colors and then bright colors because... For the bear, you can do dull colors, and then for the balloons, it's going to be bright. This one is one of my favorites. Um, I love that it's just kind of a universal all-occasion card, and these stars are fabulous. So they used a few different things on this card. They First, they used the uh, stencil 
for the background for the honeycombs and this is called honeycomb stencil it is also by penny black and then for the stars we have this cool die um, that's called stars and circles and so they use the star frame, but then you've also got these other dies that they included on the inside that you could use for other things. So I love <coughs> that they cut two different of those stars out and kind of staggered them. And then over the top, we have some butterflies, and those are from this set here, which is called Flourish and Butterflies. So that's one of my favorites from the set. And then the sentiment, um, we'll have to... Oh, do some digging and I'm in the process of writing everything on the backs so that you guys know what was exactly what was used but I don't have those done yet. Here I have a Mom Mary, happy you can be birthday. in the video. Head on over. <laughs> happy birthday card. It says every moment spent with you is like a beautiful dream come true. Oh, no. Cute little saying. Very bright. And then the here saying, is the saying is bright. How can the saying be bright? It's like that. <laughs> um, and then here I have Rose Garden uh, stamp. It's very pretty and elegant. And then I just have a border die, and it's super cute. It's got these fun little bunnies, and it is called Mischievous Bunnies. And you've got um, the different bunnies all in a row, and then you've also got some separate pieces too. There's some uh, carrots and some uh, carrot toppers and there is a bow and um like a bow tie and a hair bow so you could make these girl or bow girl or boy bunnies depending on what you wanted or you could just leave them as they are and not put bows on them at all but that's a fun border to add to a easter card here i have two flowers you're so thoughtful is the same and i don't know where this background is mom can you find that very pretty. Um, I think that one we it's already like have in stock. I don't think that came in today's shipment, but I think okay. we already have that we one too. We already have this one, so make sure to buy it. And I like how this one, they cut the bottoms off. So then they got a lot of use out of just one stamp. And they look completely different than the others. So here we have a couple different samples from the same um, stamp set. This is the exact same stamp, and it's called... Uh, flutter by and this is what it looks like and I love that they just took a portion of the stamp on this one and stamped it twice and it gives a totally different look and um, it's just really nice and then I even like how they tied the uh, gold string on there just kind of something different really pretty and again that one is called flutter by and these are all penny black here I have floral citadel. Floral silhouette. Floral silhouette. <laughs> like a pirouette, only a silhouette. <laughs> you want to show us a pirouette? Dun, 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 dun. You better do it right. <laughs> okay, we're not sure exactly how she placed so well this weekend after that uh, move that she just did, <laughs> but uh, she did somehow get a platinum okay. at dance this weekend, so... <laughs> She did pretty well. Okay. This says, good luck with everything. It has some cute stamps and flowers. And on the back, it has an example. All right. So I've got framed thanks is what this one's called. And it actually says, thank you, not thanks. But um, I like that it's framed and it's got um, the greenery on there. And it's just really nice. I don't have a sample using this one, but you can kind of see the sample in the background on the back of the um, packaging, and it's kind of a cool dye. Okay, here I have some flowers in a jar with a little cute bow that says, wish I was there to give you a hug. And then I have a dye for that called um, the Tall Flowers. So I have these two. Do you know what tall means? <laughs> <laughs> Poor Brigan. I don't think she's ever going to grow. <laughs> Alright, so here is a, another sample. And this is using the Penny Black Soft Spoken stamp. And it has a stem, but they didn't use it in this sample. So, really easy, really simple, but beautiful card. 
done with the soft spoken stamp set. Here I have these two samples. I think these are probably one of my favorites. Just look how cute they are. Um, I have. It's just yeah. This is the dye used to make the grass, which this one is called Love Always, and it's just got these little hearts popping up from the ground, and um, they kind of look like flowers, but they are hearts. hearts. And so that's what was used for both of those samples to make the grass. And then here I have the stamp, and it's called Clear Set, no, Smile. Smiling. Mm, smiling, exclamation point. <laughs> Is that what you're uh, always doing, smiling? <laughs> the few sayings are, congratulations, you make me smile, you're so cute. We have a bunch of cute different ones on there. All right, and our last sample, right? Is this our yes. last sample? Okay, so this is our last sample, and this one is done using the stamp called A Moment in Time, and it's really pretty, like, packaging doesn't even do this sample justice. Like, this is so nice. And then on the back, you can see it colored in pink. Look at the detail on that stem. That's just crazy, like, how... Yeah. It looks how pretty it is and then we've got a couple other s items here so this one is called delicious beauty or no delicate beauty not delicious you don't want to eat the flowers you just want to look at the flowers um, your sentiments on here are thinking of you and then you've got all these different flowers and here is a die that I forgot to show with one of the uh, other stamps that we already showed you this is for the radiant flower and this is called radiant cutout and then you've also got the words uh, mini thanks on there and then we have one more die to show you again I apologize for that big mess in the background um, this one is called butterfly garden cutout and you've got lots of different butterflies on there it looks like you've got about six different butterflies and then you've got uh, three different florals that you can put with the butterflies so that's a really nice set and I don't know where she went, but she keeps popping in and out. <laughs> um, but anyway, thanks for uh, watching this video and supporting your local shop. And we will get these. Actually, these are already out on the shelves. But I will get the samples uh, finished up and I squeeze to, in here. I need to talk to them. Uh, hold after. on. Um, we will get the samples finished up. I'll get everything written on the back so that you know what to find. Because um, sometimes when we can't put the sample by the... Um, actual item because that item is on several different cards so we put them as close to them as possible but it's just easier if we can keep the items written on the back so we'll get that finished up and get those samples out for you and we appreciate you shopping local so come see us at scrap mania we're open every day at 10 a.m 319-377-9999 what do you have to say um i have to say that my mom spent a lot of money and my dad doesn't know so he had to come get it all okay her dad knows I spend a lot of money, so that's not a secret. But you do have to come by it all. Would you stop it? So come see what you can find at uh, the store that's going to make your cards even more beautiful than they already are. And we can't wait to see you soon. Shop local. Have a good day. Bye.